Cirque du Soleil's OVO is coming to Portland, and all week we're giving you behind the scenes tours of this traveling show. That's right. They've had sold out shows all over the world. I spent some time with the OVO team in Santa Monica, and they show me how they make every performance just like the first. Cirque du Soleil's OVO is a two hour infusion of larger than life characters, music, dance, and acrobatic feats. It takes you inside an energized world of insects, though you've never seen insects like this. Ovo means egg in Portuguese. The story shows you what happens to a tight community when a foreigner carrying an egg drops by. It's a love story, a comedy. Robin Haupt is one of the only American performers. She developed the spider. Quirky and strange and devilish, but we're also kind of sexy and sensual and um, you know, we do what spiders do. We seduce and kill. We catch her and one of the crickets practicing. She's been in more than 1,000 shows. So how does she make every performance like the first? I come onto the stage and I see these people sitting there and they're so excited. And it makes me excited too. You know, I, I just put myself in their place. We're backstage as Sebastian Laifa, one of the crickets, learns a new character. It involves a lot of strength to move as an insect on stilts. To bend, bend the knee or bend one elbow or put the head on the side and small stuff like that. Before the show, I talked with a woman who oversees OVO's world tour. She's proud of her team's hard work. I'm also proud that we still have most of our original cast because they love so much to do what they do. And that's saying something, as they sometimes perform 10 times a week. Hmm. Well, we're giving you a chance to go backstage at OVO when they come to Portland. You can watch for the character of the day to appear on the screen during the Coin Local 6 newscast at 4 o'clock. And then you can text or email for a chance to win. OVO opens April 5th. And for more information, go to coinlocal6.com.